it's me, Jess Back again for another review. This time I'm looking at from the Bacon 2012 Shattered Glass Invasion Souvenir Figure in Shattered Glass Optimus Prime. Now, Prime here is a redeco of the reveal, the shield, Optimus Prime. I gotta say, in vehicle mode, he looks pretty impressive. Are these silver paint strokes what's supposed to to me look like just paint wear it's just the paint on the vehicle mode has just been worn off all you see is the metallic metal alloy underneath which looks really cool and you got the green headlights here got a pretty nice messed up looking Autobot symbol cracked windshield with very glittery yellow translucent plastic with some green lights on top more of that silver paint strokes got this random lightning bolt don't know why it's there but hey i'm not and even back here just having the black mix in with those silver paint stripes right here paint strokes looks really cool i really do like that look you know optimus is like tagline you no know, one shall stand one shall fall whoa we have shattered glass prime here on this side it says i shall stand the rest shall fall and he's got to reveal the chill emblem. Let's find out what he is. He's an Autobot. And he's a truck with six wheels, so he's going to roll pretty awesome. All right, let's take Optimus Prime here from vehicle mode into his robot mode. And here we have Optimus Prime in his robot mode. Now we're going to look at the head sculpt. It's very nice. I really do like the mixtures of the very kind of dark blue, gray helmet. Mostly gray. Silver faceplate red eyes and the nice gold right here on his crest and the translucent yellow plastic that's you know behind his head then you got his chest it's very cool make sure it's the purple black and whatnot you got a little pink got a little gold here on his crotch area and yeah he's got a sparkly sparkly chest very very glittery and then you have his shoulder mounted piece here it, they use the same translucent plastic all in here but it's kind of hard to see but besides that you know Nice purple painted on the shoulder area. And on the arm, as you can see, that same translucent yellow plastic right here on the bicep. And we have the nice purple here and got some gold applications on his arm. And then we have a sculpted hand. And then we have his legs. I, again, really like the whole silver paint that they did on this figure. It just looks really cool, very gritty. And got some mixtures of some gold and some very shiny silver on the lower part of the legs. Articulation. His head can turn all the way around. You can go up, you can go down, and bob side to side. His arms can turn all the way around, go in and out a bit. You can go in and out over here, twist above the arm, elbow joint. And his wrist can rotate and pivot in and out. His legs go forward and back, go in and out, turn at the upper leg, knee joint. And his feet can pivot and go forward and back. Now this being the leader of the Autobot, he's crazy. He's badass looking. But as you can see from his back, he does carry his mighty sword that's using the same type of glittery yellow plastic as his chest. So overall, Optimus Prime here is a really nice figure. I really do like it. I like the mold they used. I wasn't too keen on them using Optimus Prime from the Shattered Glass universe again since we did get him in the 2008 using the classic figure mode but having him in hand he's very impressive I actually like him better than the 2008 figure I mean he just looks really nice in vehicle mode robot mode the paint applications is really nice articulation is really good and I would recommend him if you do not have the 2008 Optimus Prime and you want a Shattered Glass Prime, he's definitely one to get. But that is me. You don't have to agree with me. So hopefully you enjoyed this review. I am Jay Asante with the BotCon 2012 Shattered Glass Invasion Souvenir Figure Shattered Glass Optimus Prime. And I'll talk to you all later.